What is up, YouTube? We're back in another video. This video, we're going to be opening 150 recruit packs, which is technically 149, but because I accidentally opened one, we're going to be looking to try pull some new cards. See the packs are profitable now with the boosted odds. The odds have went up a little bit. I'll show you guys real quick if I if the game lets me go into the store. This game is very slow today, but recruit packs. We have a 9% um, chance at 77 plus, and our topper with 12% for 80 plus. Will these packs be able to top what we put from freshman packs? Probably not. Because these packs are cheaper, but spent 225k on these packs. We're opening these packs pretty quickly because there's a lot of them. A lot, a lot, a lot of these packs. Okay, we got. I'm expecting. Hopefully, we get some 80 pluses. Probably like four, maybe. With boosted odds, you assume you pull more 80 pluses, but who knows? These packs don't always tend to be the best, to be honest with you, because they're 65 plus packs. They're not normally very good. I'm just gonna get grazed the whole time, but um, yeah, 70 overall. To profits, we are to pull some good, we're pull some 78s and some 79s, at least a good amount of them, because they do go for a little bit more than what they normally go for because of the set for XP that people have been doing last week. But we do have 75 overall. It'd be pretty crazy if we can go with LTD. Last time we opened recruit packs, we did pull an LTD, but that was out of a lot more packs. That was out of like 500 packs, which is a lot more than 150. But to not bore you guys, I'm gonna open. I'll open all these pack, all these regular packs off camera. And I'll show you what we get at the end. I'm opening all 150 of those packs. I did not know what we got because I backed out all, out of every single one of those packs. We're gonna be on our toppers first, then we're gonna go check what we got from the regular recruit packs. All these toppers are, I'm expecting to get good pulls because they're now 70 plus overalls. I mean, 70 plus is still not very high, but we did pull LTD out of these last time. And those are 69 plus. So who knows? Can we pull fire out of these? Probably not, but maybe. You get a 74 kicker. Take it, I guess. Maybe profit on, profit on pack, maybe? Be the kicker? I'll, I'll be flipping out those kickers though next week when Mad comes out. Those kickers will be flipping out, flipping on the auction. It's like crazy for me. But next one we got, uh, we have. Uh, I'm guessing we do get our first 75 plus. We got 76 overall receiver. Pack number five of these toppers. We have 15 of these toppers total. We do get a uh, green again, a uh, 76 overall lineman from Notre Dame. The Fighting Irish. Interesting. I don't know why they're named that, but I don't know. We got a 72 corner, 74. These, these toppers don't really feel like toppers, honestly. These, they just feel like more recruit packs. Just in a form of, of a fantasy pack. But I get to choose between two bum players instead of one bum player. A 70 overall quarterback. That's really our best pull out of that pack, seriously. 71 and a 70. You just feel like recruit packs would take longer to open right now, honestly. But hopefully, we can get that big pull that we need. We got a 73 overall player right there, free safety. It's got 225k to open, so we need we do need pulls out of this opening so we don't lose 200k. We got 73. Five packs left to go. Can we pull anything to end? We do get an 80 overall Booger McFarland right there. I will take that. Four packs left to go. Let's see what we get. 71, 73. We get a guy named Tutin, I think. Might be his name, might not be his name, I don't know. We get a 73 and a 72. I think we have two packs left. Two packs left. Can we pull a buzzer beater on these toppers? A 73 overall. Okay, these toppers are not. They don't. They they're not good. Let's be honest. They're not, they're not good at all. So we get last one. 74 overall. Well, let's hope. 
when I go to my inventory, there's good cards in there because I did not check on what we got out of this pack. So something sold. I don't know what sold, but something sold. So I'm gonna go in here. Let's so far this is a random program. Let's season one, and then go in here, click the newest. Let's go through all all our pulls. We have eight overall, obviously from our toppers. We do have eight overall left tackle right there in recruit pack. That's a good pull. Um, we have a two overall safety. That's good. Eighty one safety. I like that. Still some decent pulls. Anything else? Anything else is a real question. Um. Does a overall Devin Grant, and that is all from the opening music. Opening started right here for this trait. This guy, this culprit guy. So everything above him, we pulled. How much does a three overall player go for? Where is he again? He's up here. Uh, left tackle, Miles Hinton from Michigan. Which does it go for? Sixty k. Nice pull. Pretty nice pull. Honestly. Did I pull anything? I don't think any. We didn't pull anything fantastic. Hopefully, we can get our coins back out of this opening, though. It's probably close, honestly. Maybe it's not close. I have no idea, really. Because prices are prices are changing a lot right now because the pack odds have went up. I think A's are going for like. Let's check. Let's just go to the auction and go we'll check right now. We're going to check 8 to 81s and 8 or 82s. 8 to 81s go for. They go for, I'm guessing, 9k? 9, 10k around, like a little under 10k for 80s. 81s go for 11k. And our 82 goes for, I think, 19 probably. 21, 21k? Not bad. And then our, our gold wise, if we go check those prices, we check right here. I don't think we got any 79 though. Maybe if we do get 79, they go for 7k. 79s go for, I think, 5k. And. This, that, yeah. It's not great. I, I feel like we did lose in the opening, but maybe we didn't. These packs, they are, they are low risk, lower risk, but there's still, there's still a risk to open them because it's always a pack. Packs are always risky to open. This guy does go for a little bit more, but he's a safety, which is sort of nice. Hopefully you can sell for 26k. Cards are really hard to sell today because of the market's flooded. The market is really flooded with high overall cards. Like, I don't know if the card's actually going to sell or not, but I'll try selling for 11k. Who knows what's going to happen with him. But, let's go look. Do we get any 78s and 79s? We did get a 79 and a 78 right there. So, that's good to know. We did get a 79 overall, which this is a 7k card. Pretty good. Pretty good. Flipping gold is not going to be bad today. There's, there's going to be a lot of gold up popping up for like 3k, 2k for people just throwing up a minimum price, honestly. Like I'll take, I'll definitely take the coins. Like it, it's free profit if you're flipping probably those cards right now. But be sure to like, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.